wanted to thank you guys for all the love and comments that you left on my last video in my collaboration with Karen from Waterfall Acrylics. I am so glad that you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you'll continue to watch my videos and I hope I'll be able to continue to inspire you. Really quick, I wanted to show you guys the dry results of the video you'll be seeing today. This is a 12 by 24 Chaos Dutch Pour. I can barely fit it in the frame, it's so big. Um, I believe they're calling them Chaos Dutch Pours. I'm not 100% sure, but I personally like the term Chaos Dutch Pour, so that is what I'm going to be using. <laughs> Um, I love this blue. This is actually a sky blue light by Amsterdam. It's so pretty and it dries really pretty too. The other colors that I used were Prussian blue, Payne's gray, silver, white. And for the first time I tried this Arteza. It's pearl glacier blue with mica. It has very, very pretty mica shimmery pigments in it. So I was very happy with that. I, I liked the results on this one as well. The formula I use for my Dutch pours, and it's not for all of my Dutch pours, but definitely the majority, is one part paint to two parts Floetrol to one part water. And for me, that just gives a really good consistency for the Dutch pours. Again, that's just my personal opinion. Um, also, please don't forget to check out the description box. I will have listed the paint that I use, the formulas. Also, my Etsy shop, my Redbubble shop, um, Pinterest, Facebook, Instagram, all that information is down in the description box. So please check that out. And one last thing before I show you guys the video. Um, I wanted to see if maybe you could leave a comment down below letting me know what kind of or what styles of paintings you would like to see. And also if you would like for me to talk more during my paintings. Um, I am not very good at multitasking, so I'm not very good at painting and talking at the same time. If you guys check out some of my old videos, oof, um, I mainly would just talk through those videos. And I noticed that I get so wrapped up in the creative process <laughs> and so focused on the painting that I'm doing that, you know, two or three or four minutes will go by and I won't have said anything. <laughs> so. It's kind of hard for me to talk and paint and do a video at the same time. But if that's something you guys are interested in, I would definitely be willing to give it a try. Um, maybe not all of the videos would be that way, but at least some, you know, so that way you guys could kind of get to know my thought process. So yeah, just send me a comment. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Thank you.